It's now time for the VP playback. Let's go. Okay, let's go to Crockett. As you can see, it's senior day and all the seniors are coming out with their parents. You know, this is a special day because it's championship day for the Pioneers as they take on the Daniel Boone Trailblazers. And boy, look, the moon is set. The mood is set. This is going to be right tonight. I feel it. All right, we wanted to let the chorus go ahead and sing to set the stage for tonight's exciting game. Oh boy, this is a good one. You know, it's party time at Crockett. It's always a party time. It's like the best party to have is at Davy Crockett on Friday night. As you can see them getting excited, jumping around, and getting ready for their team to come out with the smoke just like rock stars. Check them out. Coming out with the American flag and the pioneer pride. And there comes the Boone Trailblazers as they bust through. And the crowds are just ecstatic for a great night of football at Davy Crockett. The fireworks are going off. I mean, you cannot beat the atmosphere at Davy Crockett. Man. All right, let's go ahead and let's get things started with the kickoff. Davy Crockett, not such a good kick. I don't know if that was strategy or not, but, uh, you know, it puts boom close to midfield right off the bat. But anyway, Harold, that quarterback, you know he's quick. And he's got something up his sleeve, and it looks like he decides to keep it. And what? He just what? The ball just slipped out of his hand, and it falls into the hands of Davy Crockett. As you can see, they take over at the start of the game, and the crowd. Oh my gosh, they're going crazy! Like, are you kidding me? We already did it. Make some big things happen tonight because we've got K Lock and that quarterback. Did you see he drives back, he rolls out, and he finds one of the receivers. And if we can get a glance at him, there he is. That's number nine. That is the tight end for Crockett. Mark Sadler as he look this time finds Michael Robinson, but it's fourth down. So you know K Lock says, no problem. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna roll out again. I'm gonna find somebody across the middle. Boom! There he is. Michael. One more time, Robinson. For the first down in the Crockett fans here. Yes, let's go get a touchdown. And they try to do it right off the bat, just like that. There he is, posing for the camera. Nice. Number three, Dante Hacker. You know that he's going to always bring fireworks to the game. That's Crockett leads 7 0. Yeah, put your hands up in the air. Yeah, we're feeling real good right about now. Boone says, wait a minute, it's our turn. So let's see what Harold's going to do for the Daniel Boone Trailblazers as he trails his way down the middle for a first down. And Boone says, hey, we're not done. As Harold says, I'm going to show my speed and I'm going to zip through. And he almost rolls in for a touchdown. Man, he was so close. So this time, what are you going to do? Well, he decides to say, I'm going, I went right and I'm going left. And I went so fast, the cameraman lost me. But Come on, Chris, give me a touchdown. Boom! Just like that. Real quick, boom, strikes back. It's 7-7. Oh, yes, you know we got a game. This is the musket bowl, baby. All right, we get things going, Larkins, to one of his main receivers, the tight end. You saw Mark there a little bit earlier. He's catching a lot of passes for him, and now he's hitting Michael. He's called Michael Robinson's name a lot, and this time Larkins looks, and he's going to find his running back. That's Prince Colley. This time, Fakes gives it to Prince Colley. Boom! Busts up the middle. Touchdown! Mm. See, that's right. They say, yeah! This is how you do it. Fireworks and all for the Musket Bowl. Playing for a championship game. What? 14-7. Crack it over. Boom. Boom says, look. We're going to maybe pass. We like to run, but we're going to run. Uh-oh. <sighs> Nothing happened there. Anyway, turn the ball back over to Larkins. And nice catch going in high in the sky. That is my man, Dante Hackler. He had a big game. And, well, uh, he wasn't good enough, though. Crockett had the punt. And I'm not sure how strong that kicking game is. Anyway, boom. Fights for some hard yardage and uh, tries to get a first down. And just a little bit short, that was actually fourth down. So Crockett takes over in the crowd, as you can see. He's like, yes, come on. We need to put more points on the board. Come on, let's put this thing away. And he finds his tight end again. It's Mark. 
busting for the hard yards for the first down. And this time, Larkins finds number seven. We've called his name a lot already, too, Michael Robinson. And Larkins, this time, he goes across the middle, wide open. Dante Hagler inside the five, but you know, time is running out, only 34 seconds left. What are you going to do? Well, you know, I'd probably just run the ball, maybe cut a time out, but no, like I said, I'm going to roll out, I'm going to find somebody in zone, but uh, yeah, I don't know who he was looking for, but it goes in the hands of Devin White for Boom, and the Boom fans says, yes, only 14-7, as the Daniel Boone Band plays for halftime, and there you get a little taste of the Crockett Band. I'm going to give you a little sample of each band. And Crockett also had something else going on. I had a little dance team there get a little halftime show. So, let's wrap things up with the halftime show and continue with the Musket Bowl in the third quarter as Kate Larkin says, I'm going to stay in the air up there. And there we go. Prince Connie for a nice catch this time. Kate Larkin. Oh, he is up in the backfield. That's number two. He knows what to do. Peyton Nichols takes him down. And Cade Larkin says, hey, wait a minute, wait a minute. You're not going to get me this side. There's my man right there. He is. Boom. I got him. I see you. That's my tight end. That's him, Mark. Side move one more time. Hey, we calling his name a whole lot this time. He's going deep in the sky. And yeah, he's a dang, I should have had it. You know why? Because it was fourth down. Turns the ball over. Gets boom. Uh-oh, Charlie Cole, boom, rubble stumbles and fumbles, oh, and who's got the ball, who's got, Crockett says, we got it, we got it, we got it, and, who, 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 we got it, anyway, Charlie Cole says, I'll do it again, this time he rumbles and he stumbles, but he does not fumble his way for a first down, and boom, looks like they're going to get a little more mental giving that ball to Charlie Cole, but this time, whoop, fumble, this time it is a turnover, and Crockett recovers, and look at the crowd there. I mean, they were standing room only at the Musket Bowl. Look how deep the crowd goes. Just standing to watch the game. Anyway, Larkins goes in the sky again. He finds the Prince of Crockett, Prince Collie. And Larkins looks, goes, the duck pass to his, whoo, oh, lands on his head. That was uh, Joyner running back. Larkins, of course, keeps it in the air. And he finds. There he is, the Prince of Crocker, but it's fourth down. He's a little bit short. This time, Larkins, what do you think? In the air again? That's right. Nice catch. Always pulling up. out. That's Mr. Clutch. Number three, Dante Hackler. And the cross is, mm-hmm, we'll take that. Okay, Larkins, of course, in the air. And this time, touchdown. Michael Robinson says, here you go, bro. Sorry about that. But touchdown, Crockett. Looks like the fireworks have come out again and Crockett split. So look, we'll try to take this lead. But uh-oh. They miss. That's your point. That could haunt them a little bit later again. Keeps it at 20 to 7. Crockett, ah, that's I don't know about the kicking game and the strategy there, but anyway. Looks like Crockett gets the ball! It's a fumble! But wait a minute, the ref says, the ref says, well, in the meantime, look at my man Phil Griffin. Look, 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 I've got the ball. It's right here. We got the ball. Anyway. Charlie Cole, they fake it to him, rolls up, Harold Fines, 14, Devon White, tonight, it's all right, first down, Daniel Boone, as they look to trailblaze their way back into the game, but it's fourth quarter, that's why right, get your hands up in the air, uh-huh, okay, we are going to this is the biggest football party on a Friday night, right here at Davy Crockett, anyway, Boone says we ain't got time we got to make things happen, but, you know, dumped in the backfield. That was Charlie Cole, believe it or not. Fourth down, what are you going to do? A lot of options here. Uh-oh. There he is. Gives it to number one for fun. Brandon Blair. Right there. There he is. He says, there we go, ref. We're back in the game. Don't count us out. Boone says, yeah, 14-20. Boone just down by six points. Watkins, of course, Takes it high in the sky, but uh-oh, you saw all the dirty laundry fall on the field and pass interference. Puts Crockett in good field position to try to get another oh, touchdown. And move! Cross the middle. There he is. Dante Hagler. And as you can see, the standing room crowd. I mean, it was deep that night. It was just an amazing crowd to see. But anyway, Marcus, what do you think he's going to do? He didn't go to the sky this time. He fakes it. He gets to his running back. 
Best joiner, as you can see, man, swift on his feet. They can't get him down. Fourth down, though. What are you going to do? Well, this time, Larkins looks to give it to his running back, Prince Colley, which is also a receiver. Well, he's a little bit of everything. Anyway, across the middle, coming to your TV screen, number three, Dante Haggis is, uh-huh. This is what we're talking about. This is how you do it. This is how you start running away with this game. Fireworks go up in the air. And this was an amazing night for Crockett. And you know, it was so good. I decided to leave to beat the traffic. And unfortunately, I didn't get the ending in this game. And believe it or not, Boone took the lead late in the fourth quarter. But Crockett came back to win the game. Big with two minutes left, but it wasn't over then because Boone gets the ball back, and with 12 seconds left, they had a chance to win, but turns the ball over, and Crockett wins the Musket Bowl for 2018 and our conference champs.